Hi friends, now we are going to discuss psychiatry goal questions. We start with question number one. This is repeatedly asked topic, clozapine. Okay. Yes, in 23 NEET, the same question was asked, little bit different. Yes, they asked question, their patient is uh, taking two antipsychotic for four to six weeks, but no benefit. Uh, which drug you will give? So clozapine is drug of choice for treatment resistant schizophrenia when you say treatment resistant schizophrenia if two antipsychotics two antipsychotics suppose a patient came to me having typical symptom of schizophrenia i made the diagnosis of schizophrenia i started with olanzapine patient is not improving for four to six weeks i changed the drug halopidol four to six weeks means two antipsychotic i tried but failed Yes, no improvement. I said this is a treatment resistant schizophrenia. I will start clozapine. So this is treatment resistant schizophrenia. But clozapine, we have kept it for the last. Why? Because it is having so many side effects, serious side effects. One of them is agranulocytosis, which require regular monitoring. This was a question. Side effect for which regular monitoring is required for the patient on clozapine. The answer is. A granulocytosis, this was the answer. And second option, option B, suicidal tendency. No, clozapine has anti suicidal property. Question has been asked clozapine, anti suicidal property. Yes, I do remember clozapine as close up. Clozapine as close up. Okay, whenever you do brush with close up, there will be salivation. So, question is asked very common side effect. Yes. This is mnemonic. Whenever you do brush, it may be close up or any other toothpaste. Salivation would be there. There, So increase salivation. If you are doing brush very rapidly, anybody who would see would say he is having scissors. Yes, close up pain. Next side effect, dose dependent side effect. Dose dependent side effect. That is generalized tonic clonic scissor. Okay, that is dose dependent. If you do brush properly, there would be no granule. A granulocytosis. Raju, tumhare daat to motiyo jaise chamak rahe hain. Mnemonic. A granulocytosis. This is very dangerous side effect. That's why we should monitor the patient every week. TLC, DLC. What I said? Every week TLC, DLC. Every week for six months this question has been asked previously in aims okay in morsley it is given four months but synopsis latest latest edition given six month question in aims was asked that you should monitor tlc dlc at least for six months every week every week okay so in this question now you can mark answer very easily side effect for which regular monitoring is required patient on pain answer is a granulocytosis yes you can give other options and any doubt you have yes again repeat question tactile hallucination in cocaine also called formication magnan phenomena magnan phenomena i remember cocaine as coca-cola yes cocaine as Coca-Cola, if you drink Coca-Cola so many so frequently, your tongue would be a little bit brown, dark brown, just like black. Question is asked that cocaine cause jet black tongue. Jet black tongue. Yes, this is mnemonic by color, mnemonic by the name. Yes, cocaine, cockroach. Yes, if a patient is taking cocaine, he may feel cockroach or insects are crawling under the skin, tactile hallucination, it is also called cocaine bug or formication or magnan phenomena, okay? So this is a repeat question. One more question, if you are using cocaine so frequently, there would be vasoconstriction, there will be perforation of nasal septum, yes, coca, Punjabi mein kehte hai, coca, coca, nitra, coca, coca, we wear coca at different places, most frequently at nose, nasal septal. The nasal septum nasal septal perforation. Okay. Now, cocaine, one question was asked. Means the topics are being repeated. So many questions has been asked recently on cocaine. A question was asked that cocaine, which of the following is not a uh, symptom of cocaine intoxication? 
cocaine cause tachycardia increase norepinephrine so increase bp tachycardia so question was asked that which of the following is not a side effect or symptom of toxicity answer was bradycardia dipsomania yes alcohol excessive desire to take alcohol how i remember by mnemonic whenever we take alcohol we should not take alcohol we all know yes but what we do we dip our finger and then we take yes few of you must be aware about that so two questions repeated topic third la bella indifference yes this is again repeat from 23 the question was in 23 neat that uh, there is a girl after such some trauma she started having blindness okay and the emotions were not matching with the loss means normally suppose a girl came to your you in emergency and she is having blindness she can't visualize anything what would be her emotion yes she would say doctor doctor please save me my eyes are gone but these patients of conversion disorder what i said conversion disorder previous name was hysteria previous name was hysteria this girl would come doctor sir i can't see yes when you will ask what is your problem she would say ela means emotions yes indifference emotions are not matching with the loss so this is seen in conversion disorder what is conversion disorder this is conscious mind preconscious unconscious whenever stress comes in our life extra stress is transferred to unconscious mind when unconscious mind is full of stress conflicts this extra conflict can be converted to symptoms converted to what i said converted to physical symptom means unconscious conflicts are converted to physical symptom just like i give example there is a girl father was scolding and she had seizure pseudo seizure that means she was having so much of conflict at her unconscious mind and she, her unconscious mind converted that extra conflict to physical symptom in the form of in the form of pseudo seizure or pseudo blindness and in this how you will recognize or you make diagnosis one symptom is labella indifference means if a person is having blindness would manifest with so much of anxiety doxa doxa please save me but in this conversion disorder she would not have emotion matching with the loss repeat question in a different way now scope criteria repeat question from nimens five year back around Men's question was asked: Scoff criteria or questionnaire is used for eating disorder? Yes. Scoff questionnaire. Five questions are there. Do you make yourself sick because of because you feel uncomfortably full? Yes. S for sick. S for this. Do you worry that you have lost control? C for control over how much you eat. have you recently lost more than one o so one stone okay in three month period do you believe yourself to be fat f would you say that food dominates your life so if score is more than 2 then it may be anorexia nervosa or bulimia nervosa yes any question yes if you want to add any thing or you want to modify option you can what is the antidepressant agent most likely cause persistent reaction yes that is again repeat question of pharma or you can say psychiatry trazodone okay no need to discuss which of the following is correct about lithium yes lithium always has been very high leading topic you all know lithium lithium normal side effect is fine tremors fine tremors yes if a patient is on lithium came to me i asked the patient to stretch hand when he stretch hand yes there may be tremors these are fine tremors sometimes you will find the patient you can't see the tremors then what you will do you will take a paper and put paper on the hand and you can 
analyze these tremor by looking at fan. Okay, these are fine tremors and these are normal side effect of lithium at therapeutic dose. We don't worry. We just add beta blocker. Beta blocker. But if lithium toxicity more than 1.5 milli equivalent per liter, then it is toxicity and lithium toxicity cause tremors. So if fine tremors, then no need to worry, just add beta blocker, coarse tremor, you will check reflex, hyper reflexia may be there, tremors may be there, ataxia may be there, okay, coma, death, and you may require dialysis. So fine tremors is the answer, it is teratogenic. Yes, it causes Epstein anomaly. Repeat question. Epstein anomaly. Okay. Absorbed from gut. Not approved for absences. Okay. Last question, I think. Yes, this is def definitely a new question. Yes. New drug approved for rat syndrome recently, two, three months back. This drug has been approved. This drug has been approved. Crofin. Uh, yes. Prophenetide, FDA approval. What is the function of this? Yes, it stimulates synaptic maturation. Synaptic maturation. Yes, rat syndrome. Again, repeat topic. Question was asked. Rat syndrome is having microcephaly. Question has been asked. Rat, if I draw rat like this, it's having very small head. Microcephaly. In NEAT 23 question was asked, it is X-linked dominant, one question. It is exclusively found in females. Yes, previously there was a, there was a statement uh, that uh, rat syndromes are exclusively found in females. But recently few patients of rat syndrome found in male also or few male rat syndrome patient has been reported. Now we started saying female more common than male any other question yes